Yes, sir. LeBron James wanted to sign Luka Doncic to a sneaker deal. What's up, MDB fam? We back with another video. Today, we're talking about LeBron James, who originally wanted to sign Luka Doncic to a shoe deal before Luka signed with Jordan Brand. So LeBron was on the Uninterrupted podcast. He owns Uninterrupted. That's like his sports media company. He has shows like The Shop on there where people are in the barbershop drinking wine, stuff like that. So he was on Uninterrupted podcast and he made a comment about how before Luca signed with Jordan, like this is a while before, he had talked to Nike about starting his own brand with Nike. He was going to sign pretty much the LeBron brand. Like, you know how there's the Jordan brand with Nike. You know how Stephen Curry just announced the Curry brand with Under Armour. LeBron was going to do the LeBron brand with Nike. And he, he said he wanted his first signing to be Luka Doncic. So Luka Doncic would have been signed to the LeBron brand in this ideal scenario. So LeBron was going to sign Luka to the LeBron brand. Luka's signature shoe was going to be released as the first LeBron brand sneaker. And I think it's just interesting because Luka... He's like the biggest player of this generation. Like he's the new it guy. Like all the young kids like LeBron. I mean, all the young kids like Luca. All the kids want to be like Luca. All the kids want to play like Luca. Before Luca, kids wanted to play like Steph. All the kids wanted to play like Steph. They're all shooting threes. Now all the kids want to be like Luca. So I think it's interesting that LeBron had the foresight to see like, yo, this guy's going to be special in this league. He's a once in a lifetime generation, once in a lifetime talent. And I want to get this guy as the first athlete on my brand. So the LeBron brand, brand with Luka Doncic would have been huge. The shoes would have sold out immediately. Unfortunately, things never panned out. LeBron stated that the, his team at Nike just wasn't ready to step forward with a LeBron brand. As you can see, there's still no LeBron brand. LeBron has his own shoes, but they're Nike shoes. He hasn't created the LeBron brand yet. I think when LeBron does create the LeBron brand, um, I don't know how well it's going to work because... With the Jordan brand, the reason why it took off so much is that Jordan was still playing in the primes of his career when the shoes were being released. LeBron, he's past his prime. He only has about four more years left in the league. So even if you were to create the LeBron brand now, you're not going to get as much. Um, it's not going to be as popular as the Jordan brand. Like Jordan had iconic moments in each shoe that made people want to wear the shoe for those moments. Like the shoes that he wore in the flu game, the shoes that he wore in Space Jam, shit like that. The shoes that he wore in certain dunk contests, those make those shoes infamous and iconic that make people want to buy those shoes. LeBron, with the LeBron brand, he still have iconic moments in each shoe. Like he'd have his farewell game, like his final game before he retires, those shoes would be iconic. Shoes that he wears in the finals, those would be iconic. But it's just, he doesn't have as much time to create the popularity that Le that uh, Jordan had. If he did get Luca though, Luca could be like his Jordan for his brand. So how Jordan was to the Jordan brand, Luca could have been to the LeBron brand. Like Luca winning his first chip in the Luca ones, Luca winning his first MVP in the Luca twos, Luca going back to back MVPs in the Luca fours. Like you know what I'm saying? Like Luca could have done iconic things with the LeBron brand sneaker, but it just never panned out. So with LeBron. If the LeBron brand does come out, I just don't think it's going to be as popular as Jordan brand. Like back in the days, I wasn't alive for this, but I heard that each time Jordan would release a shoe, then the commentators would talk about it all game. Like before the game, while he's warming up, wearing the shoes, they'd be like, those are the new Jordan sixes. As you can see, Jordan's wearing these. Da -da 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 and they would talk about it for like 30 minutes. So I think that just gave Jordan a heads up over the competition because as you're looking at it back in the days everyone used to watch TV at the same time now guys are watching YouTube highlights they're watching they're listening to podcasts not everyone is watching the game so back then you had a lot of people all eyes on Jordan now you're not going to get that same impact in terms of all eyes on LeBron yes we have Instagram pages like slam kicks and stuff like that but it's just not the same anyways boys I'm going to wrap up this video LeBron wanted to sign Luca to a sneaker deal Unfortunately, it didn't pan out, but I think it would have been interesting. Luka is going to be one of the best players that we have in the future of the NBA. So thanks for watching the video, boys. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. We do new NBA videos every week. Peace.